Hello viewers, this is Tej Patel. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to use AT command mode in HC05 Bluetooth module using a CP2102 USB to TTL converter. Here I have got an HC05 Bluetooth module. This module can be used in both modes, master mode and slave mode. Here this is a CP2102 USB to TTL converter and I have attached female to female jumper wires with it by using which we will connect both the modules with each other. Here I am connecting both the modules with each other using this jumper wires. First of all, we will connect the 33 volt pin of the CP2102 module with the more pin of the HC05 module. Then we will connect the ground pin of both modules with each other. Then we need to connect the VCC pin of both modules with each other. Now make sure we need to connect the RX and TX pin of both modules with each other into cross connection. So the TXD pin of CP2102 will be connected to the RXD pin of the HC05 module and the RXD pin of the CP2102 module with the HC05 module TXD pin. Now both the modules are connected with each other. So we will connect the HC05 module and CP2102 module with the laptop and the USB port will be inserted into the computer port. Now the both modules are connected with laptop. So we will go to the software side. Here I am using Teradom software. So I will open it. Here we need to select the COM port which falls in serial port. So I will select COM port 5 because my device is connected to COM port 5. Few more settings are to be changed in this software. So first go to setup then terminal. Change CR tab into CR plus LF from the transmit tab and make sure the local echo is ticked up because the lo local echo will help you see what you write on the screen. Then again go to setup and then serial port. You need to select the board rate which is 38400 which is the board rate from the factory settings. Now we need to type AT. It shows OK. So it means that the PC is connected to the Bluetooth module and the Bluetooth module is in AT command mode. Now for asking the name you can type AT plus name followed by a question mark. It will show the current Bluetooth name. To change it type AT plus name is equal to what you want. Let's say 1, 2, 3. You may ask it again AT plus name followed by a question mark. So it will show the current Bluetooth name. Now for password you may type AT plus PSWD followed by a question mark which will show the current password. For changing it you may type AT plus PSWD is equal to 0000. So the password has been changed. You can check it by AT plus PSWD followed by a question mark which will show the current password. You know that the Bluetooth module can be worked, particularly this Bluetooth module HC05 can be worked in both module, in role master and in role of slave. For role of master we need to select 1 and for slave we need to select 0. So we may ask it AT plus role question mark it will show 0 which is the current mode slave mode. To change it we can type AT plus role is equal to 1. So now the current role is 1. You may check it again AT plus role and a question mark which is master mode. Now for checking the address basically the address is required when you are pairing two Bluetooth devices. So for checking the address you may type AT plus ADDR followed by a question mark which will show the current address. I mean to say it will show the current address of the Bluetooth device which is a permanent address. Now you can type AT plus UART 
a question mark which will show the current baud rate of the module which is 38400 we may change it by 80 plus uart is equal to 9600,0,0 the two zeros are the syntax so we need to type like this it will show okay you may check it again by u a r t followed by question mark so it is 9600 now for resetting the module to the factory settings we may type 80 plus o r g l for and enter so it's now resetted so you can check it by 80 plus name and it will show the factory name thanks for watching the video i hope you liked it well please don't forget to subscribe like share and comment